I'm Alec Doyle and welcome to episode 6 of Jetstream. We're back here at the Northgate Arena as the Cheshire Jets return from a couple of weeks on the road, having picked up two wins before a shock defeat at Durham on Saturday. I'll be asking Bill Cole what life on the road with the Jets is like compared to his college road trips, and Keith Page becomes the latest victim of the return of the shot clock. Bill, welcome back to Jetstream. Uh, you've been on the road with the guys for two weeks and three successive games. Now, how does it differ from playing at home? Uh, you know, you just you got the away crowd factor, and, and they're getting loud, and um, you know sometimes they can you know they can affect free throw shooting. But actually, last night we shot pretty good, so I think we've done well. It hadn't had too much uh, effect on us, you know, free throw wise, or you know, or them you know putting pressure on us with their fans. The squad's still getting to know each other. On a long road trip to Guildford or Durham, what have you learned about your teammates that you hadn't noticed before? Uh, you know, I've learned we've got a gritty team that has shown some heart in those two games. Uh, Guildford, we came back from, you know, like a 14-point deficit and won the game. And, and last night, we were down 17 and a half. We came back. We didn't do what we wanted to do. We didn't finish the game, but, you know, it was still, we're never out of it with this team. That's what I've learned. Now, Adam Brown referred last week to the siege mentality within the squad when you're away from home. How can you replicate the positive effect of that here at the Northgate? Uh, yeah, I think it's going to be it's going to be uh, a big deal for us to defend our home court. We haven't done so so far, and, and that's you know that's one of the keys to having a, a championship season is is you know not losing on your home court. So we've got to kind of switch that around so far. Now the Jets did seem to hit a run of form before then. Um, Durham Wildcats sprung a surprise defeat. What really do you think went wrong on Saturday? Uh, you know they were hitting. They were, uh, our defense wasn't very good, and they they were hitting shots. And when those two things combine, it can it can lead to a rough. It led to a rough first half. And by the time we got our defense together, it was you know just te- it just turned out to be too big of a hole to climb back out. And it's often said that you learn more in defeat than victory. What did you learn from that loss? Uh, we've got to play for 40 minutes. It seems like the last two or three games we've you know we've had really good second halves, but our first half we came out kind of sluggish and slow. So. Hopefully today we'll we'll turn that around and we'll come out we'll come out with a bang. Bill, thanks for joining me. Keith Page, you've got 24 seconds to answer as many quick fire questions as you can. Your time starts now. Money or fame? Uh, with fame comes money, so I guess both. <laughs> Eminem over vanilla ice. Uh, I can't go vanilla rice. <laughs> NBA Jam or NBA 2K12? Oh, 2K12. Fruit or veg? Uh, fruit. Pacino or De Niro? Oh, heat. Where they're both in it. <laughs> <laughs> sweet or sour? Uh, sweet. TV or YouTube? Uh, TV. At your time. Thanks again for joining me for another episode of Jetstream. Remember, for all the latest Cheshire Jets news, like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter and tune in every Thursday for the latest episode. You might also want to sponsor my moustache growing efforts for Movember, a fundraising effort in aid of male cancer research. If so, please follow this link. For now, I've been Alec Doyle. Thank you for watching.